opening with a catchy tune featuring a cowbell. Clang, hear that? That's the sound of a cowbell, an instrument that might seem unassuming, but plays a pivotal role in some of the most memorable songs in music history. Consider, for instance, the iconic track, Don't Fear the Reaper, by Blue Oyster Cult. The haunting melody, combined with the persistent, almost hypnotic cowbell rhythm, creates an unforgettable auditory experience. The cowbell in this song isn't just a background noise, it's a character, a driving force that propels the song forward. Now, think about a song without a cowbell. Take, for example, Hey Jude by The Beatles. While it's a beautiful song in its own right, imagine for a moment how it might sound with a well-placed cowbell rhythm. It could add another layer of complexity, another dimension to an already timeless piece of music. But what exactly sets songs with cowbells apart from those without? Well, the cowbell adds a unique sonic texture that's hard to replicate with any other instrument. It's a sound that cuts through the mix, offering a rhythmic backbone to a track that can make it more engaging and dynamic. On the other hand, songs without a cowbell can sometimes lack this rhythmic intensity. They may rely heavily on other percussive elements, but without the cowbell's distinctive clang, they often lack a certain spark, a certain energy that can set a song apart. Take another example, Low Rider by War. The cowbell in this song is so fundamental that it's practically another member of the band. It sets the tempo, creates the rhythm, and gives the track its distinctive groove. Without it, Low Rider just wouldn't be the same. Contrast that with a song like Imagine by John Lennon. While it's a powerful song with a strong message, a cowbell could add a whole new element to the track, providing a rhythmic counterpoint to Lennon's piano and enhancing the overall musical experience. So, what have we learned? The cowbell, though often overlooked, can be a game-changer in music. It adds a unique sonic texture, provides a rhythmic backbone, and brings an energy to a song that can elevate it from good to great. Songs without a cowbell can still be beautiful, of course, but they often lack the rhythmic intensity and unique sonic texture that a cowbell can provide. It's like adding seasoning to a dish. Without it, the meal might still be filling, but it won't have that extra flavor that makes it truly memorable. In conclusion, don't underestimate the power of the cowbell. It's not just an instrument. It's a secret ingredient that can make a good song great. So next time you listen to a track, pay attention to the cowbell. You might just find that it's the key to the song's appeal.